pumpkin event. That's what you're getting tonight. And you know what I'm venting about? Venting. <laughs> Christmas shopping. Christmas shopping. I went to finish shopping. And I don't know if any of, a, of you know this. Maybe you deal with it yourself. But I don't do well in public settings where there's groups of people. So shopping around the Christmas season. <sighs> I can tell you I have been known to go shopping on a weekend and leave my cart or carts, plural, completely packed full of groceries that we've needed for weeks and I've left it there and walked out before over anxiety. <laughs> so knowing that nobody else would be able to do this <coughs> for me, this is my job and my job alone because Jake is gone. Nobody else knows what needs to be bought. I went to Target and was on a mission. One of those missions was trying to find Jake. One of those gifts I asked Jake weeks ago, give me an idea of what you want or what you need. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. And so I even went to the extent of making sure I had a list ready because I didn't want to be the one doing the I don't know game and then being annoyed because nothing happened on Christmas. I know that he's so, too humble to give a crap, but I really didn't want him to go without. And so I wandered around Target for pff, ever. I was gonna get him a toaster and then I keep thinking, he can't take a toaster back with him. I don't know, I'm just trying to, or I could ship it out. I just don't, I know whatever I get him, I keep thinking it has to go back with them. Oh, so frustrating. And so I ended up finding him something that he can just, he's gonna turn into a big kid. I don't know what else to get him. So I'm really hoping that he'll appreciate what I found. I don't know what else to get. But I found a couple other things like Emberly needed needs dresses severely. Desperately, because I'm getting really tall and She keeps growing and I can't afford it. Um, so the dresses are not, are they for Christmas? Not technically. She I just, grandma just bought her two dresses and she's already too like tall. So they're way too short and it's not something that we're okay with her wearing. And so I had to go and find something. So that's what I did. But in the meantime, I deal with stupid people. Ugh! You know the people that pull everything off the rack and if they pull it down to take a look and they're too lazy to put it back? Come on, man. Stop being lazy. Or how about those people that like, my favorite, the ones that stand in the middle of the aisle and act like they're the only ones in the damn store. Get the crap out of my way. Gosh, oh, my favorite though is coming up to the front to check out and people are standing there trying to decide if they want to buy something. Get out of my way, go do that somewhere else. Like, oh my hell. I about throat punched multiple people. Or my favorite is the layering that they do at Target with the registers. So you got like one, two, three, four, five, whatever. Or I don't know how they do it, one, a whole row of registers and then a whole layer, the next layer is behind it or something. So the ones that come up to see the registers, they're like, oh, I'm gonna stand in line. Half of them don't even know what line they're standing in. Super annoying. So I, this guy and his wife was like staring at magazines and the register in front of the register that they were standing in was empty. Like I think people think that that was the same line or something. I could see that it was obviously not. So I asked, I said, are you going to be going down to that register? They're standing right in the way. And the wife looks at the husband and she's like, oh no, then get the hell out of my way. So of course I'm like, well, thanks, move, excuse me. Blah, 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 blah. And then the people that stand there and wait for the people that are actually, you know, paying for whatever, the other people just stand there. And then they act all annoyed that you asked them to move. Like, excuse me, you're standing in the way. <sighs> Do you feel my frustration here? 
And then, uh, what's my, oh yeah, parking. Parking's a blast. Driving on the roads with idiots that think that they're the only ones there. Like, come on. Oh, I can't handle it. I really can't. I went to multiple stores. It was frustrating. And quite frankly, I really don't care if I'm done with the, with the, what do you call it? No, the stockings. Whatever is in that stocking, that's all there is. I'm not getting any more. I refuse. I'm not going back out there. I did all my shopping on Amazon. 90% of my shopping went, was on Amazon. <sighs> the kids better be okay with it. They will. They'll be grateful. Anyways, that's my rant. I'm sorry, you guys. Love you guys. Thanks for your support. And have a good night or day or whenever you're watching this. See you tomorrow. Bye.